vitamin D is really important to keep bone, teeth, and muscle healthy. It helps the body absorb the right amount of calcium, and this is essential for bone health. Without enough vitamin D, children can develop rickets, which can cause bowed legs, stunted growth, and brittle bones that break easily. It's important to know that infants and children of any age can have severe vitamin deficiency. In 2023, we checked the vitamin D levels of over 4,200 children at CHEO. Of those, 30% had vitamin D insufficiency and 8% had vitamin D deficiency. It's also important to mention that infants and children from Indigenous and First Nations communities, especially those living in Northern communities, are even more impacted by vitamin D deficiency. Sources of vitamin D include sunshine, certain foods, and supplements. As for the sun, our skin naturally produces vitamin D when bare skin is exposed to sunlight at a certain strength. That's why we call it the sunshine vitamin. However, there are no safe UV exposure that allows for enough vitamin D synthesis without increasing the risk of skin cancer. The other thing that's worth mentioning is that in Ottawa, from November to January, the sun is not strong enough to make the required amount of vitamin D. In addition, people with dark or melanated skin tones need longer sun exposure to absorb the same amount of vitamin D. So the darker or the more melanated skin tone, the longer the exposure is needed. It's very important to ensure that children have enough vitamin D from food or from supplement throughout the year. You can get it naturally in eggs, fatty fish like salmon, arctic jar, and rainbow trout. In Canada, we also add it to some foods. All the milk sold in Canada is fortified with vitamin D. There are certain types of margarine, tofu, orange juice, and yogurt that have fortification of vitamin D. So, what I want you to remember is that if your child is not able to get enough vitamin D through their food, or if a child's at risk of vitamin D deficiency, then it is prudent to take a vitamin D supplement. Thank you.